Hello guys, welcome back. Got another build order video for you. So this time uh, we're going to be doing a build with Khmer. Um, obviously they have a nice little wood bonus because you don't need to build any buildings. To, there's no building requirements to click up. Um, so we're going to do 23 pop up. Not make any villages in Feudal Age and just click straight to Castle Age instantly. Um, it should and it should ideally hit Castle Age at 12 minutes and 45 seconds with no idle time at all. Um, so as with just about every single build on the planet, you start with six villages on sheep. Um, we're then going to go to wood. One to wood. You can see there's only three deer on this map. And this build works perfectly fine with three deer. You do have a little idle time once you're in Castle Age on your TC. Because it, you're unable to afford to produce villagers. If you have four deer, it solves that problem. You don't have any idle time at all. You'll be able to build, make villagers non-stop. So yeah, we're sending four villagers to wood. Um, I'll put the full breakdown of the build in the description. Um, so sorry, three villagers to wood. And then we build a house on the way to the boar with the next villager. And then we send, I think it's four villagers. In fact, we send three villagers from the TC to berries. And as the mill's the last building we need to build, apart from houses, we also take one of these villages from wood and send them to berries as well. Yeah. We don't need any more than two villages on wood now. So here's the first villager coming in. This villager's gone from wood and going to berries. And we send one more villager to berries. And then the next two villagers go to boar. So obviously one goes to collect the second boar. And one goes under the TC to eat existing boars. So there's one on the way to get the new boar. And the next one goes under the TC to eat existing boars. Building a house with one of the berry villagers. We could have done it with one of the wood villagers, it's not important which one does it. And now we send two more villagers to berries. But I think I'm doing it slightly differently. Yeah, so we sent one extra to four. Or two extra to boar, sorry, and now we're sending the two to berries. So you end up with 11 on boar, or under the TC eating food. You end up with six on berries. And now the last two, three, go to gold. And then we don't make any more villagers till, castle, till we're in Castle Age. Pushing the deer in. Two more villagers to come. We don't get loom in this build either. Six on berries. We've only got two on wood. Obviously one of the wood villagers went to berries. Feudal clicked. And just keep a close eye on our resources. These shouldn't 
stand out. There we go. Straight away. Nearly eaten all the food under the TC. Just got cows left. Hey, so today. Scout out scouting. Got enough wood to build a mi uh, another mining camp if you wanted to go to stone and build a castle. Or. So you've got options from this point now. Once all the food's eaten, you can transition the villagers either to stone, to wood, to gold, depending on what you want to do once you're in Castle Age. Just need a hundred more food in, got the gold. Quick force drop. And we're up. So, I'm going to do a castle drop build. Start transitioning some villages away. Sending all these villages to stone. Building another house. Got double bit tax coming in as well. Got loom queued up. Don't need three on gold anymore. Gold's not a critical resource now. Got 11 on stone this time. We are going to struggle with stone. We'll probably be a bit short once we hit Castle Age. But we won't be far off. We can now send these villagers forward. Walls are very close on this map. Oh, they're going forwards. I left one on berries. Just so I've got some food coming in. Got one villager queued up. Almost got enough. There, I've got an. Oh, she sent it forward as well. As you can see with stone, we're going to be about 100 and something short. Got 100 gold though, we could buy some. Which I think is what I'd do on this. But oh, oh, we don't have a market then, as with Khmer. But villagers are forward. Just waiting for the last bit of gold stone to come in. Transition away. There we are, we've got enough stone for a castle. Now really it's just a case of being able to afford farms. But yeah. There you go. Had a couple of seconds idle. 10.05 was perfect to feudal. But we had two seconds idle time. As we force dropped and clicked castle. But yeah, hope you enjoyed that.